What's good, folks? How you living? It's your boy, the Mixed Monster, DJ Coach K here, and welcome to Ask a Real DJ. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my gosh. Before we get started, do me a favor. Do yourself a favor. Like, love, follow, and subscribe to all my social media pages from Facebook to YouTube, if you haven't already, at DJ Coach K and at the Mixed Monster. And when subscribing to YouTube, be sure to hit that little bell on the side right here to get reminders of new videos coming out each and every Wednesday right here on Ask a Real DJ on YouTube. And also any other videos I throw out there during the week, well, consider those bonus. But hitting that bell will let you know you got the chance to catch it first. All right? Okay, ladies and gentlemen, DJs, DJs, do me a favor, stop with the Serato face mommy. Okay, we gotta stop that. I see you. Oh, stop it right now. Okay, DJs, we're gonna stop that right now because here's the deal. I gotta ask this question. Why is it there are so many DJs doing the Serato face mummy? Come on, man. DJs, whether you look like you're doing it or not, when you're rocking on live stream, I gotta ask this question. What is up with the lack of personality, man? Come on, man. It makes it sound great, but if you're expecting people to stay on your live stream, whatever it may be, Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, uh, Twitch, Periscope, what, what is it, Mixer? Huh? You tell me. I don't know. You gotta be somewhat engaging. You gotta be somewhat entertaining, man. Stop standing there looking like you was hypnotized mm -hmm. or you're just scared to make eye contact. You're like, yeah, I don't want people to see me. Stop it. Please stop it. The difference between people staying locked into your show for just one minute and them deciding to stay on your show for at least a good hour or so is your willingness to give people quality content. Think about how many times you gave a new TV show a chance. Hmm. You either enjoyed it, that you said, you know what, I'm going to catch it each and every week, and wanted to see it so many more times, or you simply said, you know what, I'll pass. Might have gave it another shot, and you still passed after that one. You said, nah, I'm good. But you get my point. Listen, I'm not expecting you to come up with cheap gimmicks. I'm not expecting you to pump your fist like your poly D. Yeah, man, rock it on, dude. I'm not expecting that. But... Here's the deal. People want you to give them reasons why they should stay rocking with you throughout your whole set. Then to just hear some good mixes. You know what? They could do that anywhere. Because even the best sound of DJs, let me tell you something. They lose a crowd when they have no substance to provide their audience. Bottom line. In other words, you can sound great from a technical side. Mixes sick. Transitions, oh my goodness. Ah oh man, scratches on point. Yeah, oh man, blends. Mm, you know what I mean? All of that and then some. But you know what? Who cares? Nobody cares. If you're not relating to your audience, it's like, well, it's kind of like playing, trying to play Biggie Smalls to a crowd that only wants Frank Sinatra. Think about that. So that whole Serato face mummy thing, I see the screen. You know what? Isn't working. Not working. Standing there, staring at your computer screen the whole time, all scared to even look at your chat room is not what a DJ does. If you love what you do, you need to relax, relate, and release, and open up a little, and bring people in to your world. That's the one thing I do whenever I do my live streams or whenever... I do a, a, a bit, an event live. Lord, please bring those events back to us. I truly miss them. You get my point? Okay. Now, the same way, just think about this. Just like they expect you to give them that same thing in person, they want you to give them that same thing online. The one thing I do in the midst of what I'm doing, shoot, engage my crowd. Shouting people out, sharing stories of people I know personally, but making sure that while I'm doing these stories that it fits in line with the music. That people want to say, wow. You know, showing people my love, 
each and every person that comes on. Anyone that joins my, you know, joins me on whatever live stream I'm on, truly appreciate it, especially the new listeners, the new viewers, because they get a kick out of me saying, oh, what's good? How you living, so-and-so? Joe, Joe, what's good? And Joe may have never heard me before. Jane, what's how you living? And Jane may have never heard me before, but it makes him stay. Because I'm showing them a genuine interest in the fact that, hey, I appreciate the fact you joined me. So, hey, you here? Let's have some fun. All right? Just showing people what you love to do. DJs, DJs, enjoy the moment with the people that whole time you're with them enjoy that moment stop being so focused on mixing by looking at a computer screen like you know I see you stop it that is annoying man I, I go to so many DJ screens and I'm see, you know live streams and I'm seeing them just staring at the screen staring at the screen staring at the screen staring at the screen and it's just sad we gotta stop that man all DJs. I'm not saying you, you can't look at the screen to do what you got to do, but let's not get so focused on the screen that we're stuck on the screen. Okay? Our eyes are planted on the screen. Our eyes are not planted anywhere else. You're so scared of messing up that you think people are going to judge you. Guess what? They're going to judge you if you're good, bad, or ugly. They're going to judge you anyway. So do you. All right? Oh, man. Before I get out of here, once again, do me and yourself a favor. Like, love, follow, and subscribe to all my social media pages from YouTube to Facebook, from Facebook to YouTube, if you haven't already, at DJ Coach K and at The Mix Monster. And when subscribing to YouTube, hit that little bell at the bottom to get reminders on the side of the word that says subscribe for each and every Wednesday right here on YouTube, Ask A Real DJ. All right, anything else is a bonus, but you'll know that is coming if you just hit that little bell right now. Okay, it's your boy, the Mix Monster, DJ Coach K, saying, I'm up, I'm out of here, see ya, where you want to be ya, I'm out, salute, deuces, and I totally messed that up, but oh well, you get the point, get out of here.